C. Lindelof videos, AP Calculus, who are asked in this um, case to find the equation of the line normal to the function at a given point. So when you see this, a line normal, I want you to think two things. I want you to think line tangent, and then I want you to think perpendicular to that. So let's start with this. Uh, first, we have to find the, the slope of the line tangent. So let's find y prime, and y prime should be negative 2 over x minus 3 squared. You take your time and differentiate that, but that's what I got, isn't it? That is what I got. And then I'm going to evaluate y prime at 5, y5, five, because they gave me the x value of my point is 5. Would be 5 minus 2 is... Five, I'm sorry, five, yeah, 5 minus 3 is 2, 2 squared is 4, so negative 1 half is negative 1 half. This is where we get to lines perpendicular. If you remember from geometry, the slope of a line perpendicular to another line has its opposite reciprocal slope. So a little note to yourself from geometry, opposite reciprocal. So opposite is that this thing is negative 1 half, so this will be positive. Reciprocal, I have 1 over 2, so I'll just flip that and turn it to 2 over 1, so 2 over 1, which is 2. What did I get here? I got the slope. This is the slope of the perpendicular line. From here, it's really, really easy. You just use your point-slope theorem, which is y minus y sub 1, and y sub 1 they provided us right here is 1, is equal to the slope of that perpendicular line, which we figured out by taking the reciprocal, the opposite reciprocal of the line tangent, which was 2, x minus x sub 1, and x sub 1, of course, they gave us right here. So this is 5, minus 5. So if I simplify all this crap out, I should get y is equal to 2x minus 9. Is that right? 2x minus 9, that's what I got. All right? Not a very difficult thing at all. So you're asking me why bother with it? Because you're going to get two or three of these things for free on the exam, and the difference between a four and five might be that question. So thanks for watching. Any questions or comments, let me know. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do.